Special Secret Reskers Are you an obese Fred lover who is forced to be on a diet? And you just cannot imagine life without those mouth-watering delicacies? Have you always been taught that in order to lose weight, you have to give up all good food, right? Wrong. You've decided that a low-calorie diet is a right thing for you. Now, how will you make this? work for you. There are several things that you will want to take into consideration when it comes to these diet plans. First off, realize that you are committing yourself to a lifestyle change, one that will take practice and dedication to pull off. No diet is easy. But, remember this. For this sacrifice, you gain added years on your life, health, and more energy as most People who lose weight will do all of these things and more. Now, how will you begin to manage your low-calorie diet? First, consider one of the most important things to you. That is your nutrition. You can't lose weight or become healthier if you are not eating the right foods. In fact, you will find that you just can't lose weight effectively if your body is struggling to maintain its health and well-being. Therefore, take some time to take into consideration not only low-calorie foods but also low-calorie foods that are nutritiously balanced for your health. You may find that you are not getting enough nutrients into your system with a low-calorie diet. Vitamins and minerals are very important not only for health but for weight loss too. If you find that you can't get enough in your restricted diet, you may want to consider adding supplements. To your diet. Talk to your doctor about any medications you may be taking and also determine the best quality supplements on the market before selecting them. Your low calorie diet really can work if you dedicate the time and energy to making sure that the food that you do consume is both low calorie as well as high in nutrients. Low-calorie diet, no-calorie foods. Since you are on a low-calorie diet, it would be great to find out if there actually are foods that you can consume that have no calories to them. That would give you the benefit of being able to satisfy your hunger without having to worsen your diet plans. The fact is that there are some good low-calorie foods that you should be considering. If in fact you do need to help stave off those hunger pains, this may be the way to make sure it happens. When considering foods that are labeled on the market as being no calorie, take a look at them. If they are very costly, they may not be worth it. While all foods have some calories to them, some will offer a much better take than others would. What if the no calorie product tastes awful? Look for a product that is low calorie, then. Low is better than no for taste and better than full calorie, too. What about all of those products that claim to be negative calorie foods? Negative calorie foods are actually foods that do have calories, but they often take more work to consume than the calories that are actually in them. For example, if you are eating a food that contains 100 calories but it takes you 150 calories to consume it, it is actually reducing your calories by 50. Just to eat it? A good example if that of celery, it takes your body a while to actually digest it. Which can leave you with a full feeling that also is cutting away at your intake. 